All right. Okay, here we go. All right, so um, we're going to do some circuits today. Um, documentation's completed. We've got a position suitable for starting. Um, Seatbelts. My goodness, what's... Okay. Okay. Seatbelts are secure. Uh, not outdoors. Doors. Latched. Uh, my doors open. Uh, fuel selector is on. Fuel quantity, we have sufficient fuel. Brakes are on. Uh, strobe is off. Avionics is, well I've left them on so we've got, um, we got sound on the GoPro. Uh, master switch is on. Ignition switch is on. Uh, fuel pump on. Leave it running for five seconds. Yeah. Working okay. Um, carburetor heat off. Choke. Uh, it's already started up for the day, so we should be right. Okay. We'll do our check clear. Right. Brakes on. All pressures risen straight into the green. Okay. Okay, so we're set for idle. 1200 RPM. Okay, strokes off. All pressure's in the green yet. Avionics on. They are. Checking the frequency, it's 126.7, which is the CTAF. Uh, we have 122.6, which is the Brisbane um, uh, air, aerodrome. Pressure altitude's still, still warming up. Okay, we can go out to our holding point. We can do our pre take, uh, pre -ta do our run ups. Okay, brakes are off. got a bit of a crosswind today. Okay. The checklist. 
Okay, here we go. Run ups. Okay, so we can do our run ups now. We can power up to 2000 RPM. Brakes are on. Got 2000 RPM. One mag off. Second mag off. Hardly any drop. And carby heat out. Little drop. Bring it back to idle. Okay, so um, all your T's and P's are in the green, which is the good. Got good oil pressure. Um, check for idle. Yeah, we're back on idle. Okay, pre takeoff. Our trim will set for takeoff. Fuel, fuel pumps on. And we got sufficient quantity of fuel. Um, flaps set for takeoff. Our first stage flap. Instruments. We can set the altimeter 20 feet above sea level, which is where we are. Switches all on, um, and circuit breakers are all in. Controls are full, free, and correct. Just the trim. Hatches and harnesses are closed and secure. Okay, the transponder is on 1200. And takeoff safety briefing. Okay, so if we have an engine failure prior to takeoff, we uh, reduce the power and um, apply the brakes to a stop. If we have an engine failure below 500 feet, We'll um, uh, tilt the nose down and trim for 65 knots, looking for a suitable place to land within the windscreen. If we have an engine failure above 500 feet, we'll lower the nose and uh, trim for 65 knots, looking for a suitable place to land left to right with making general turns. Okay, it's our safety brief. Um, do our radio call. They will be entering and rolling runway 26 circuits. South Grafton traffic, Jabiru 7216 entering and rolling runway 26 for circuit South Grafton. Okay. Checking for traffic in the circuit. We've got a bit of a crosswind. Right, no other traffic in the circuit. Checking for live. Animals on the runway, we're right. Oh yeah, we're up. Bit of crosswind this morning. Okay, we're up to 400 feet, our flaps can go away. Checking for traffic. Turning onto our cross.
last one leg. Channel 10. Checking for traffic, turning onto a down one leg. Okay, we're at circuit height already. Okay, we're in power back 2800. Let the aircraft settle. Just the trim. Okay. Do our downwind checks. Our brakes are off. Free and pressure foul. Fuel. We have sufficient fuel. Selectors on. Fuel pumps on. Um, instruments, T's and P's are in the green. Switches are all on. Circuit breakers are in. Hatches and harnesses are closed and secure. Downwind checks are complete. 